Hi everybody, it's Marsha and Kaylee from Hidden Treasure Candles. Um, that board kind of took a minute. It took while. Well, I started at 3 o'clock. It took a little while. I've had boards last longer, but uh, I have to finish cooking dinner. My husband's waiting on me to cook him a steak. So, anyway, here is the board for tonight. Um, it's a 45 box board. I've got everybody's names. There was a lot of scratching on there and scribbling on there because I had to, well, I had to let some other numbers go. So, um, Anyway, thank you, Tanya, for picking up those extra numbers. And so this is what the board looks like to those of you out there that are have not played this before. This is what I do. I, I draw boxes up, in this case, 45 boxes. I number them. You tell me what number you want, and I write your name down into that box. And then I have my trusty little butterfly box. Um, mm -hmm. And I still have a couple new players out there, so I want you guys to know, if you was to order a box of tarts for me from Hidden Treasure Candles, they would come in a box similar like this. They've got three or four different designs. This one's got butterflies on it. Um, I have another box around here too that's a different design that's really cute. But I'm not sure where it went. I don't, I don't know where it is. I probably knew where it is. So, well, we'll just we'll get it for the next time. But anyway, these boxes have magnetic closure. They open up and close. Um, when you get them, if you used to order this, it would have ten clamshells in it. Um, right now, this is where I have all the numbers at. I've got 45 numbers in there, folded up on a piece of paper. Um, and I'm going to shake it up. I probably want to get this drawing done quick. We're going to do bingo, a free game of bingo after this is over. Bingo. Um, but I have to get the steak cooked. I have to, it's, it's kind of, what time is it? I check. 7.45. So I have to, the baked potatoes are done. I just have to cook the steak, so. And then after I get the steaks cooked, then we'll do the bingo. And luckily we eat our steak medium rare around here, so it won't take very long to cook. So anyway, Kaylee's going to draw the numbers tonight. And there's three winners. Ooh. For cash candles, the last time I checked, a lot was below 30. There was a, there was less than 30 cash candles left. And the uh, iPad Mini grand prize has not been claimed yet. So it could still very well be out there in one of the, those, you know, less than 30 candles. That's what I'm hoping for. I'm hoping with everything in me that one of my people, one of my wonderful customers, end up getting the grand prize one of these times. So, but anyway, well, one number, Kaylee, one number. We'll see who the first winner is. Round one. Do you got it? Yep. Okay. So the first number that Kaylee has drawn is. I can get it open. Number 32. I'm going to hold it up there. What does number 32 say? Deborah Otters. Congratulations, Deborah. You are the first winner tonight of the Cash Candle. So, and I will show everybody on the board. I'm going to hold it up there with my finger underneath it. There's Deborah's name. I know it shows up backwards to you guys on my camera, but Deborah's got number 32. So, congratulations, Deborah. You won the first one. And so now we have to draw two more. <laughs> I like I like doing three winners. It's kind of cool. But anyway, draw one number. That's not really good. Okay. And what number is that? Let's see. This number is number, number 26. <laughs> Deborah I'm going to hold that up there. That's Deborah again. <laughs> two. Um, that's two candles for Deborah. I'm going to hold this up. There's number 26. And then Deborah is right. Can I have my finger on 26? Um, is that 26? Right. There. Let me bring it in closer. I'm gonna bring it in closer to you guys because I can't I can't see it. But I mean I have bad eyesight, so you guys might be able to see it. Deborah is 26. So I have one more number to draw. And then remember when we get done doing this, we're gonna do a free game of bingo. It's word bingo. I've had a lot of people ask me how you play that game. Here's how you play the word bingo game. You pick out a five letter word, any five letter word you want to pick out, and you write it down. Um, you don't want to have a word that's got two of the same letters in it because I'm only when I call off the letters I'm only going to call each letter one time. So um, it goes quicker than regular bingo where you got a bunch of numbers to call. There's only so many letters in the alphabet, so it goes a little bit quicker. But there you go, take a draw. Always stuck in the Draw one more. Mm, let's see. Who did we draw this time? <laughs> and this time it is number. 44. 44, which is Linda Wilson. And I will hold this up here. Everybody can see. Linda Wilson, right, I have, I have sloppy handwriting. It's right here. 
Linda Wilson, number 44. So, congratulations to Deborah and Deborah again and Linda Wilson on winning, winning the cash candles. You guys let me know what scent you want. I already have your guys' shipping address. So, let me know what scent you want and I will get those ordered for you. And you guys, hang around for a little bit. Um, I do have to put these steaks on. My husband's starved and my kids are going to be starved. It's going on 8 o'clock. They have to go to bed at 9. So, I have to get these steaks cooked. And um, as soon as I get done cooking these steaks, I'll come back and we will do a bingo game. So, congratulations to the winners. And I'll see you all on the flip side. Bye. Bye.